Vale para allá. All right, here we go. Take three, I think it is. So as I was saying in the previous one, I'll just start over. Um, I'm doing this video today because today marks the anniversary of me being dumped via text a year ago today. And at the time, some of you may have um, been privy to some of this information. Some of you may have not, but it marked a really um, important day in my life. It's where I thought what perfection was uh or all good things come to an end i guess but it really spiraled me into a whole new brand new person um it allowed me to go into very very parts of myself that i hadn't explored yet so i wanted to take this opportunity today to celebrate to really um <laughs> sorry um that's my dog messing with my camera person right now <laughs> um but I want to take this opportunity to just kind of let you guys in on what I've been doing over there. You got some. All right, here we go again. Yeah, we do. What I've been doing this past year. We have some connection issues. I, I'm wondering if my vibration is too high. Um, what I've been doing this past year is really working on myself, really getting to a point of self-love within myself to where I can now assist others in their growth and in their depression or in their times of need my depression got to a point of suicide i know that that's not often something that i talk about but i'm to a point where i now feel comfortable actually talking about it and i'm now to a point in my own business where i now know that i have the tools and i now have the energy and the time to actually give back and um i'm inviting you guys all to join my page um if you guys have ever been depressed if you guys have ever had a heartache or heartbreak um or even just during life i mean we we have hard times on this page i will be sharing um stories i will be sharing tools um and pretty much it'll be kind of like a support group but i will be going on their live sharing my stories sharing how i did things sharing things that showed up in my life during this year, how dance saved my life, um, how it was a portion of what saved my life, how these beautiful dogs came into my reality, how um, I had to cut people off, people that I always thought were gonna be there for me, um, ended up just kind of falling away, or how maybe I cut them off, unbeknownst to me. But how everything just kind of worked itself out and how everything just really ended up making me now who I am, how everything just lined up, even the name change, everything just being um, who you see now as what I am today, being a product of that devastation, of that heartache, of that heartbreak. So today marks that anniversary and I had to do something today. I had to finally come out of my push beyond that fear, push beyond that, what are people gonna say? What are people gonna think? And um, and also stop protecting who I thought I was protecting um, by keeping my story anonymous. So um, I'm over that, I'm done doing that. Um, this person has had uh, over a year to come forward and they still haven't, so it's okay, it doesn't matter. Um, no hard feelings there. Forgiveness has been a major, major process with me. Um, for those of you who have gotten readings with me, you know that I will give you forgiveness homework because through forgiveness, um, there's so much healing. So I am inviting you guys. This is an official invitation for everyone to go ahead and join my page. Join my, um, my, uh, my page, which I will share a link to today and in the comments. Um, I really want to appreciate everybody who's been with me through this process this last year. Everybody who's made me feel like I've made a difference in your life. You have no idea how you've made a difference in my life by being there. So, um, I'm just very grateful, grateful for the new relationships I've established, the new friendships, the people. Um, I didn't realize how many actually, how many of you guys actually watch me from afar and how many of you guys have reached out to me in messages saying, hey, I've watched your process. Hey, I've watched your growth. Hey, how do you travel so much? Or how are you doing this now? Or what are you doing with your life? Or can you show me? I'm ready to show you guys now. 
So um, that's why I'm inviting you guys to my group. That's why I'm inviting you guys now to take that leap of faith with me. Um, allow me to be your mentor. Allow me to be your guide. Allow me to open myself up um, and be vulnerable to all these emotions that I'm feeling. Um, and push past the fear. Push past that judgment that you think people might have because it will be an open forum. It will be an open group. It's a closed group, but it will be open to where we share. It's um, So I invite you guys to get past that. You guys will have the opportunities to have one-on-ones with me. Um, so I'm also inviting you to do all that. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. Shoot them in the comments, I'll reply to you. Um, I just wanna thank everybody for being with me on this journey. Um, it was definitely a dark place in my life uh, the first four months, but I really appreciate everybody who was there with me. I appreciate all of the mentors I had with me and everybody who was there. So, um, I just want to invite you guys and happy anniversary to me. Um, because officially it's been one year of, of being single. Uh, a lot of you have been in on the journey of the online dating and that, well, I already know that that's, um, a whole nother monster that maybe I'll get into, uh, <laughs> Um, on my group too, but for the most part, it's going to be a lot about healing. It's going to be a lot about tapping into those emotions, tapping into that deep, dark place that a lot of us avoid. A lot of us avoid going into that depression and really feeling that depression and really feeling those emotions where we would call them negative or as I like to say, they're unbalanced. It's just like a scale. You have a scale where you have your positive and your negative on one scale, right? But when something's off balance, that's all it is. It's not positive, it's not negative, it's just unbalanced. Um, I'll just give you an example. Somebody who's, um, who's super clean, like a clean freak, they would be considered OCD. And then somebody who's super messy and super dirty is on the other scale. Well, there's a balance to just being neat and clean, right? So being OCD isn't bad or isn't good, but there's a balance to that. So there's uh, there's where you fall on the scale. So I'm inviting you guys to come in deep into your emotions and take a dive with me. Um, where my motto is, I take I take a uh, take a dive into the darkness and make the darkness my bitch. So if you guys are ready to do that, are ready to embark on this journey with me, or you guys have had something that's come up where you guys just can't get over it, or you have had a heartache that you just cannot stop thinking about this person, or a job that you've lost, a person, somebody you're grieving, it can be a dog, a cat, it doesn't matter. Um, a situation that you haven't been able to, to accomplish in your life. Um, I'm gonna let you know right now that there's hope that there are people out there that we can accomplish things even through that depression, that um, you're not alone and that there's hope out there and that even me knowing or having the answers, because I know a lot of you think that I have all the answers. Um, we actually all do. We just have to tap into it. Um, and I can teach you. So I just wanted to go ahead and make this open invitation to everybody. And just to let you guys know where I'm at now. So I will go ahead and post the uh, link to the group down below and in the comments today. And if you guys have any questions, you're more than welcome to reach out to me. Um, again... Uh, for those of you who haven't updated, my name is Ariana. It is, that is legal. It's on my driver's license. It's on the title to my house. Like, it is legal, legal. So, um, yeah. And that's that's pretty much it. So, hey, camera person, was there any questions on there? Was there any? No? All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. I just wanted to go ahead and come on and let you guys know that I will be going live about twice a week. That's my goal on that group. Um, so when you guys are ready, I'm ready for you. Love you guys. Bye.